and gentlemen, as we go into a second main entry of this beautiful Saturday here at the Dancing and Spring Run Powwow, we want to be mindful of the circle and everything it stands for. Leading this procession in here is part of what this circle stands for. It belongs to these veterans, it belongs to these warriors that you see before you. Their comrades, their brothers and sisters who are put all on the line in many places throughout the globe. Korea, Vietnam, Afghanistan, Iraq, Kuwait, Somalia. Many places unknown to those of us common folks, those of us civilians here. We select the these individuals to come in and to proudly bear these beautiful colors and the various lovely stuff that you see here. And he now presents me to the arena. So help me out, ladies and gentlemen, with a warm welcome and round of applause for our warriors. And I'm coming back here this afternoon to our next entry. I'm the king of the Eagle Staff, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Lynn Jacobs. Right there, right we want to say thank you, Mr. Jacobs, for bringing that into our circle this evening. Uh -huh. We want to recognize the members of the Lumbee Tribal Council who are in our here this evening. Your tribal leadership from right here in Lumbee Country who help make programs not just like this possible, but our youth programs, our energy programs. Things that serve the citizenry of this tribe. 55 to 60,000 pounds of new people that they serve day in and day out. So, how about the land of God for the leadership of the Indian nation, the tribal council, ladies and gentlemen?
Apaches keep them moving over here, Midnight Express.
Midnight Express boys, you stand by with a flag song for me as we allow our veterans to take care of these eco parts in the following arena here. They're gonna